Mmm, these apples are so good. Where's Fiji anyway? Somewhere near Australia? Came all this way, mm, just to end up in my mouth. All right, welcome back to the Snack Tech YouTube channel. This video is gonna be a real quick one, just to show you these really handy SCR modules you can buy on AliExpress. These are so cheap. These are cheaper than your morning cup of joe. Buck, a buck 40, something like that. Including shipping, you just gotta wait uh, five months. So if time is money, that's like a $500. And they can be used to control devices that plug into these jacks these ports what, what is this port even called nobody really knows and it's good for things like fans or lights it'll probably make leds flicker but you may have uh seen this in a previous video uh this was an enclosure from one of these ac adapters and it actually makes a pretty good we've got to put some epoxy around here it's all glued back together we don't want anyone who isn't a uh, um by the way this is highly uh dangerous uh, you should not build this these boxes are pretty rugged actually as you know because everyone has dropped one of these on their floor before and i just uh Drilled uh, two holes on each side and a really badly drilled hole here. Screwed on the potentiometer screw. Bob's your uncle. Demonstration. You see, just by turning this knob, I can control the speed of the fan. I can make it go real slow or I can make it go real fast. For all the ladies out there who want to control the intensity of their... Just flick the knob. Control the intensity of your... Your, um... Devices, you know? Hmm, I was going to show you this light bulb over here, but it no worky, so I checked what's going on, and there's a break in the line here, and I know just the perfect way to fix that. Got to hold those together, and then bring in the vice grips. There we go. And you can see, it's not the best for LEDs. Unless you want a disco, this is not the right approach. Now for the part that we've all been waiting for, including me. Squeeze out. Oh, yeah, good amount. And it's time to mix this whole load together. Now you gotta mix epoxy like the way you mix eggs. You mix it good. You don't mix a little bit. You know, when you mix eggs, if you only mix it for 10 seconds, you get bad consistency. Well, with epoxy, you don't get any indication that it's badly mixed. But if those were two colors of paint, you obviously see that it's not mixed. At Snack Tech, we mix epoxy properly. The worst insult you can give someone is telling them to mix epoxy like a girl. All right, that's well mixed. Now, we want to use this epoxy to strain relief these wires. Strain relief, uh, it's not something you do on the toilet. It's how you get the wire to not break off inside. Get in there with the epoxy we don't have all day. Get that epoxy in there. I can feel it. It's already hardening. Oh, running out of time. Oh. Wrong way. Fits perfect. At Snack Tech, we don't care if it's done perfect. We just want it to work. So it works. So I don't put ads on these videos because ads are just such a pain in the ass. You know, you gotta you gotta try and skip it, but then there's no skip button, and you're like, oh, I don't wanna I don't need to watch this bounty toilet paper ad because I buy the value brand at Walmart. So I get that. So I don't I don't advertise on these videos. But um, if you want to check out the Patreon, put some money on there. Um, then I'll have an incentive to make more videos. So check out our shop selling all kinds of junk. And see you guys in the next video. I hope you tell your friends. If you share this video, big thumbs up. If you don't like, I'll tell your mom. 